All right, guys. So uh, today, once again, uh, this is gonna be a very raw, unedited version, the raw version, uh, where I'm traveling right now, and uh, I would be just uh, saying a few things about whether you should be uh, going for the tags and how how does the algorithm of all these social media platform works and people always waste their time i would i would honestly say they are wasting their time um uh, most of the time i'm not saying that all the time they are wasting the time when they are trying to figure out the algorithm of social media platforms uh the reason being is today i'm doing this episode the only reason is yesterday's video yesterday on youtube when i did a similar kind of video which was just a raw uncut version of me filming it through my phone and uh, it was just uh, unedited there was no intro outro just like this one and because i i am doing this uh, raw uh, thing and it is not scheduled or it is not edited by the team and it is not having any thumbnail what probably it would happen is i would be just uploading that through my mobile phone wherever i will pull up my car and uh, that's it so this is how it would be but now the point which i'm trying to make over here is a lot of people they try and waste their time for all their videos with respect to their tags with respect to their keywords with respect to their title with respect to the description but they forget the human element which they have to put in in their video the emotional connect which they have to put in in their video uh, which which needs to connect all right that brand who is doing that content with the audience who is viewing or consuming that piece of content right so that is that human connect is always missing or maybe even if not human connect i understand a couple of videos might be whiteboard videos and uh, things but if i mean the, the thing which i'm right now talking about emotions and humanly connecting with the uh, your audience is with respect to the personal branding content i'm not saying that uh, this should be the same thing for uh your how to videos because obviously how to videos and all needs keywords needs uh some optimization needs a uh, beautiful thumbnail which might be a little bit clickbaity at times and uh, so that your ctr increases and in, in itself uh you'll have those animations like click the like button comment so that it engages more it gives signal positive signals that people are engaging in your content and then it would boost up in the algorithm in the first 24 hours all those things i understand all those technical things i tech uh, tactical things i i completely understand for those kind of videos but if you are doing this kind of video where you are actually com- communicating and you are just trying to connect with your audience with some sense with some uh uh, uh logical a uh, discussion i would say not a debate not a, a technical marketing perspective if you are doing this kind of video i would honestly suggest try to put out content and if your content or video or piece of uh, uh, like uh, content once again if it is able to connect with the audience then definitely people will engage people will stick to the end so that your audience retention will go high and things now the reason why i'm saying this is because yesterday's video it was just raw and cut just like this and uh, i assume that people who were commenting people who were engaging in the first 24 hours were those people who were actually watching the complete video <clears throat> right because the topic was there was actually not a topic i was i was just documenting my experiences and right at the end i said something which was do it for yourself and that was the title which i kept and there is no description because i uploaded that through my mobile phone there is no thumbnail uh the aspect ratio of that video is also vertical just like this one and uh, probably this video will also have a title which i still don't have any idea about no keywords nothing maybe later on after one week or so uh whenever we think so that we need to give some keywords for this one we might just do that my team might do that or maybe i might ask my uh, content team to create some thumbnails for this and then the thumbnails would be there but like not right now so the main important point which i'm trying to discuss over here in this short little episode is that when you are doing your personal branding content not your uh, a selling content or not your advertisement or something even if uh, at times it might be an ad content as well but when you are doing that raw human connect wala content for your audience when it comes to personal branding i guess you should be doing this kind of thing and uh, you should not restrict yourself right don't restrict yourself 